Warning! This video is a Commissar Bro Impressions review video. It is full of fake accents, noobish tinkering, and spoilerific gameplay. Viewer discretion is advised. Uh, comrades, Commissar Bro here today with Gabin, the final decision, or Gabin, depending on who you talk to. Gabin, Gabin, ah, same thing. Either which way, you play as Gabe Newell, and uh, it's the year 2096. Half Life 3, Team Fortress 3, and Portal 3 have all been released during the Triple Steam Summer Sale. And uh, that's all I really know. So without further ado, let's take a look and see what this $2.69 game actually is. Year 2096, Gaben has decided to release the Triple Steam Summer Sale, which will be releasing the games Half-Life 3, Team Fortress 3, and Portal 3. However, there is something terribly wrong, and Gaben must make his final decision before everything is too late. Gaben, finally, I'm finished! Wait, how do, how do, how do we think Gaben sounds? Finally, I'm finished! Half-Life 3 is a success! So is Team Fortress 3 and Portal 3. This will be a triple game Steam Summer Sale special. That was just awful. I like how they actually have a fucking image of Gabe Newell in here. This is ridiculous. I'm hungry. Would you like a tutorial on how to play Gaben the Final Decision? Yeah, sure, why not? To move around, press up, down, left, right. You can also press shift to run. Would you like a tutorial on how to fight? Sure, why not? There are two types of skills, one with your character's name, which is his exclusive moves, and one called special moves, which both Gaben and Mike have. When you get in a battle, if it's a boss, you will not be able to escape. However, if it's a regular enemy, you press escape, then press escape. Okay. Alright, so, <coughs> I guess we, uh, we just don't, uh, you can't use anything. And also, I notice you can't make the screen bigger. This is literally as big as it gets, and I think this is like 640 by 480. But, you know, hey, whatever. No big deal, right? No big deal. Alright, so we're walking. Walking. And he's eating. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, that was good. Now time to release a triple summer special. The fuck am I doing? <laughs> like, what is it? What's up, boss? I'm cool, right? Yeah, you are, boss. The employee. Hey, tell me more. Employee, what's up, boss? The ceiling. Ha <laughs> ha, hey, so funny. Ah, what happened to my computers? I don't know. You gonna, you gonna, you gonna show me? You gonna tell me what happened? They look exactly the same. Why isn't it working? That was my only save of Half-Life 3. I knew I couldn't trust any of the employees. Bastards. Listen up, everyone. It has come to my attention that someone has sabotaged Half-Life 3, Portal 3, and Team Fortress 3. We must find this person at once. The reward will be 20,000 Steam funds. Yeah! Good. You are all dismissed. Mike Johnson. Wait. Wait. It was Robin Walker. I saw him slip into your room. Is this true, Robin? No, it's not true. Both of you, come up to the stage. In this sea of people who all look the same. Oh my. Okay. Who destroyed the triple summer steam sale special? I forgot which one is this. <laughs> Boss, it wasn't me, I promise. Here I recorded it, the footage on my phone. Robin! Fine, you're cop -mills. Why would you do this, Robin, after everything we've done together? You weren't even one of the main developers of Team Fortress 2! That's because of the thrills! You don't understand, Robin. You're getting old. The three us or the thrills. What if everyone crashes, Robin? Why would it, Robin? I'll be the big. It'll be the biggest release in the world. The fans will go crazy. But you don't understand, the Illuminati. Look, triple threes. The Illuminati will destroy the whole company. The Illuminati will seek to destroy Valve. The release of games. The Illuminati confirmed will be everywhere. It's 2096, people, by the way, so Gaben is about 150 years old at this point. 
Then they'll think we expose them will be done. That's preposterous, Robin. The Illuminati's and blah. I've seen things that the Illuminati's right under this company. I've seen too much, and you've all seen too much. Prepare for your grave, Guy Newell. He turned into a spy. I am kind of on a low budget. So I kind of spend all my time trying to sabotage your computer. Okay, so there's a lot of dialogue here, a lot of things happening, but now we're actually going to fight. That's right, let me use my special. No special, okay? I'm not going to use my special. I'm just going to attack. Wow. <laughs> Gavin, what the fuck? Five hundred gold. Mini M bottle found. Gavin is now level eight. Wow, I leveled up eight times. Phenomenal. Well, that was weird. Um, I'm not really sure what to do now since Robin's dead. Attention, employees! This is an emergency. You all heard Robin say the Illuminati was under the company. Mike, come with me. You have things to discuss. Oh, uh, now the 20,000 sneak goes who ever finds the Illuminati. All right, boss! Good. Now you are all dismissed. Mike, I need your help. You're the only person I can trust. After all, you were the co-owner of this company. Well, what should I do? I can help you, Gabe, but you have the plan of blah because I'm still very confused about what's going on. All right, Mike. First, we have to figure out where the Illuminati is hiding and how to eliminate them. This all sounds so weird. Anyway, Mike, why exactly is Illuminati after us? Like, so what? If the internet nerds say Illuminati confirmed, who cares? Mr. Newell, I mean Gabe, we've been working together since the beginning. We've created a huge company from nothing. We're basically the smartest. But this... It doesn't seem right. As if it's some sort of gimmick or trick. We're one of the smartest people on Earth, but the problem seems unsolvable. In all honesty, Gabe, I never even believed the Illuminati was real, and right now I'm still a bit skeptical about the realism of the Illuminati. But then, why would Robin sabotage my computer and risk his own death to do it? He must have been possessed, forced in some way to do it. He was a good man! That's true. It's better to try before it's too late. What about the Triple Summer Sale Special? Well, what if it gets destroyed again? We better go find out who is behind this new one. It's the so-called Illuminati. Oh, I'm going to help you. Trust and right decision. Mark's a great joint. Class of five. So we have Summer Special. I have some supplies. Great. Oh, my God. So much fucking dialogue. No. Just... Yes, God, let's move on. I'm, I'm bored. <laughs> okay, don't get set. You can play T-Fortress 2 later. Of course. What about this? Just a bunch of programming books. Well, maybe there's a book in there that I want, so I need or could use. Well, it's TV. Nope. Well, that's great. I found a scatter garden and a Southie Shinobi. I'm so confused. <laughs> Oh, man. Mike, let's get some information from the employees. Some of them have probably got a little bit of information on the Illuminati. Good plan, Mike. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's just find the Illuminati and save Valve Corporation. Hey, boss. Just read this book. I need information on the Illuminati, you weak bitch. No? All right. What about this computer over here? What about this one? What about this one? Nope. Okay. Oh, beans. Well, let's try going down and see if we can't find someone else to talk to. Hmm. Hey, boss, just working on some software. Why did I... <laughs> you know, if I was actually a boss, in which I have been a boss before, but if I was a boss and people kept telling me, Hey, boss. Hey, boss. Hey, boss. Still researching, boss. Doing my homework, boss. Sucking a dick, boss. I would be so annoyed. Like, God. I have a name. You will call me it. <laughs> oh, man. So, this game is um, interesting. I don't know if I'm overly excited for it. I'm talking to my employees, but none of them are telling me anything. It says they want to achieve a satanic new world order. Ew. That's very strange and interesting. What is the New World Order? It says that the New World Order is a one world government for Satan. What? People are so strange today. Yes. Hmm. Do you have a good point? Good job. Keep up the good work. This is the weirdest fucking game I have literally played in weeks. I'm not going to say months, but weeks. The Illuminati has many relations with the number three. Maybe we can find them through triples or threes. Does this idea make sense? Sure, why not? <laughs> good point. Keep up the good work, you little bastard. Yeah, yes. It's a good thing we all dress in suits and ties. Also, we learned blah blah and something about being under us. What game? The basement. Mike, remember when you left Valve to go and enjoy life with your family? Because yeah, 
<laughs> what does that have to do with anything? Well, after Valve got much bigger and stuff like that, we moved our big conference to the much bigger room on the second floor. Oh, you mean the old conference room in the basement is just gone? Yep, most people in the company don't even know the basement exists. Only people like Robin know. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go to the basement. The basement should be hidden well enough to see... Switch. We play a little tune and we're in. Okay. This is so weird. <laughs> if our secret room was a bunch of flowers on the floor, I would have no one tried to look inside them. We were supposed to look at the flowers and click a hidden switch in one of them. All right, well, let's try it in threes. Nothing. So... Nope. 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 All right, well, I guess we'll just go up every single one of them. Is this is this what I do now? Is this just just what I do? Is it just fucking click flowers? This is what the commissar does? Is just click flowers and shit now? Oh, phenomenal! Awesome sauce. That's aha! Found the switch. It's really dark in here. Yeah, I wonder why we had our conference room in here. Because we're vampires and bats. We like bats. Oh my goodness! You no look familiar. Heavy's going to kill you. Boys, we can talk about this. I created you! Wait a minute. How are you alive? You're a character. Heavy thinks baby's scared. Cry, baby's cry. Um, Mike, you got anything? Um, no. Alright, well, we're fighting again. Do we have a special now? We do. Uh, this quick... HP was quick. Alright, we should do this one. Hit him. Hit him with a... Hit him, hit him with a normal attack. Boom. Attack again! Attack again! We have defeated the heavies! Gaben's party was victorious! Mini in bottles. Gaben is now level 11. <laughs> I'm just, I'm leveling up in threes. Oh my god, Gaben is the Illuminati! Illuminati confined! <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? Welcome, Gabe Newell. We were expecting your arrival. Here are you! Show yourself! Wallace Breen, the administrator, GLaDOS! Precisely, I have revealed this little secret to you, as you probably won't ever see us again. Reveal yourself, then! Well, that will remain a secret, for now at least. How are you guys even here? I mean, you're all video game characters, and on top of that, how did you know Wallace was gonna survive Half-Life 2? Because we are the Illuminati and we know everything. Guards, take this to the outside. <laughs> so, this is Gabe in the final. <laughs> prepare, f <laughs> prepare for the destruction, babies. So, <laughs> no, why? Don't move or heavy will kill you. So, this is Gabe in the final decision. I'm. Yeah, so, uh, Valve has been destroyed. The Illuminati have destroyed Valve, and it is up to Gabe Newell to. Save the world, and Valve, and Steam, because only he can do it, and, uh, yeah, yeah. So if this is your type of game, then jump in it, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> and have a ball whilst doing so. In the meantime, I'm not going to do any more spoilers, because that's not how I roll. <laughs> anyway, this has been Communist Hot Bro. Like, subscribe, comment, all that crap. And I'll see all you amazing people next time.